We spoke about last week how Candace is working on God knows what, treating God knows who. I don't know what the hell she's doing, but she's in school. And I don't think she knows. <laughs> Her professor's like, what is this you're giving me? I don't know what you're saying. And she's going around going, no, they don't understand the what I'm trying, the research, the research. No one knows what you're, you don't know what you're talking about. So the world can't know what you're talking about. <laughs> you got what? this. Listen. I think she said she was looking to find alternative remedies for treating up, social up, up, disorders. Social disorders. Up. I, you lost me. You lost me at the third word. Because her baby, one of her kids, is like has like anxiety attacks. So she didn't want to give her, you know, pills. So she wants to find natural ways of like helping her through that. I think that's what had started her reasoning behind this. Sure. Yep. Sure. Yep. So while she she's because she's in school, merch kind of takes on more of like the parenting responsibilities. Yeah. So yeah. he is going through a midlife crisis in the sense that he doesn't really know like what his role is. And yeah, life. he doesn't know who he like. He doesn't even feel like himself at home, and that's what um him and Q was talking about over tea. I said, "Who are these guys? <laughs> who, are these guys? <laughs> who are these guys? I'm all for elevating the black experience and putting us <laughs> places. Oh my God. <laughs> Not be sitting somewhere having tea. Okay. I get. I guess because they had their daughters. The daughters were doing a tea party, but they too old they for that. Could've, they could have went by themselves, too. Because it was yeah. in the Slurvy Hotel. Okay. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Having a tea party. But go ahead. Okay. So, him and his daughters are hailing a cab in 2022. Um, Kennedy said, I'm leaving to get an Uber Black. And that's when I knew these writers are not from New York. That's when I knew. That's when I knew. We, especially as black people, do not take yellow cabs. What are we doing that for? When we clearly white, have that. Right? This white lady with her dog, that's her That's her van, her car. Because that's what she does. Yeah. We are in the Ubers. Uber black, Uber, Uber. We're there. Yeah. But anywho, he's hailing the cab. Cab stops for him and his daughters. He opens the door for the daughters. And a white woman with her dog comes on on the other side and is like, this is my cab. So, you know, they get into it. We have the whole Karen episode. Um, cops come. You know, everyone's scared. All the black lives are at matter here. Okay. And um, why? Why did we do this? And like, lady, where'd you come from? You're coming on the wrong side of the street, number one. That cab was not stopping for you. That's number one. And the guy, the cab driver should have spoke up and said, hey, I stopped for her. Hey, I stopped for you. Like, that's what it should have been. Now, again, and the writers don't live in New York because the cab drivers definitely don't give a damn. Whoever comes in, comes in. Comes in. And then also, black people... Move, dog. I'm getting in. The daughter's already in. Push that dog out. Let's go, yeah. dad. Like, yeah. Not, just, oh, my God. But I guess they trying to show that, you know, the little girls, they, they suffer from social anxiety. They do. So they were immediately afraid. But she and stayed Merch in the taxi. She stayed, the the <laughs> stayed in the taxi the whole time. She did. She did. Baby girl was just. Yeah. That's why I asked how old is these kids. Yeah, but okay, they suffer from social anxiety. They do, they do. Yeah. So uh, there's just so many things because I was like, "What would I do?" But I wouldn't be stopping for. I wouldn't be hailing down a taxi. And that's that's number one, because the minute the daughter had Kennedy had said, "I'm ordering an Uber Black," I don't even know why she felt the need to say that. She could just said, "I'm ordering an Uber." And I would have said, "You know, that's our cue too. Let me order my Uber as well." Let me order mine. Like, come on, man. What are we doing? 